You might be wondering where summer went. Me too. Well, get ready, because fall is upon us. For many people, fall is the perfect opportunity to venture outside or even do some shopping at the local farmer's market. Others like to head to their neighborhood bar to watch college football games. But one thing is certain, the weather is optimal for being outside, and for some, that means taking up running. I love running. Um, short distances, one, two, or three miles max. For others, they're not 100% sold on the sport of running. Uh, I hate running. It is the absolute worst. Nobody should like to run. I don't know why people like running, but it's not fun. <laughs> okay, sure. Running isn't going to resonate with everyone. However, it is a relatively easy sport for people to get into, and there are numerous races that people can sign up for in the fall. One city that is popular with runners due to its marathon is the city of Boston. And this fall, Boston is hosting the BAA Half Marathon on November 13th, 2022. Over the past three months, I've been training for the BAA Half Marathon, and the weekend is finally here. Now, it does look like it's going to be a little bit rainy, but that's okay. I have my bags packed and I'm ready to run. So let's head to Boston. Once in Boston, I got to meet up with some other runners and find out why they were running the BAA Half Marathon. That's a good question. I think I did this to challenge myself. Um, I didn't think I'd be able to do something like this. Um, my roommate, Bobby, is the one who convinced me to run the BAA Half Marathon, and I was pretty, pretty hesitant at first. Running a half marathon can be nerve-wracking, and Amy gave a little insight into why she was nervous today. It was a little stressful for the last 24 hours because it decided to go from nice and sunny to crappy rainy. But even with the rainy weather, over 6,000 people showed up to complete the race. So I just got done running the BAA Half Marathon. And as you can tell, it's a little wet outside today. However, after running through the water, I was able to finish the race in about two hours. So there's a lot going on today. People still finishing the race, but also people celebrating the awards and their own accomplishments. You know what? It was as good as I could have asked for. Uh, I learned a lot about myself and this is a really fun time and I want to do more halves and go for a full. Definitely exceeded my expectations for it. I just had a lot of like positive thoughts and feelings about it and um, definitely walked away feeling really happy with that one. If you've ever thought about getting into the sport of running, whether it be running a 5k or even a half marathon, a great place to start is by going to a running store. And one store in particular that you might want to check out is Fleet Feet. Get fit for the right shoes. Make sure that you have the right apparel and clothing so that you're comfortable. Start small even if it's a, a walking program that leads to running. Be surprised how quickly you make gains. So with the new year right around the corner, think of this as your sign to start running.